Right, we have here a one of a kind. This is a hover around MPV5. This is the power chair, but this one has the five inch seat lift. This is the hover around MPV5 with the five inch seat lift. So this power chair has 50 miles on it. So it was used three or four months. Okay. If a person uses their chair all, all every day, they're going to put about 25 miles a month. So it's got 50 miles. I would say maybe in a span of two or three months, it was used. Okay. A couple things with this chair as we go along, I'll mention, but it's a hover around MPV5 with a five inch seat lift. If you want the seat to go up on this chair, you go to your screen and you look at the two buttons where it's a picture of a seat. You press down those buttons and then you use your joystick to make the seat, to make the seat go up. So you can see the seat going up right now. You can see it right here. That's your seat lift. Okay. And this chair will not drive with the seat elevated. So that's your six, that's your five inch seat lift. You can see the batteries for the chair is right here. The seat lift is between the two batteries. You have caster wheels in the back. These are the original tires. They look pretty new. These are nine inch tires. They're, they're kind of knobby. And, um, and then you have a seat on here. So we're going to cover the seat. Let me bring the seat back down this way. So the seat's coming back down. We're going to put it back in drive. We're going to move the chair forward and we're going to look at the front of the chair. Let me bring the chair here. All right. So you have your rounded foot plate, which is hover around is famous for. You can see the motor right here for the seat lift. Right here, there's two levers. There's a motor here and there's a motor on this side. This is where you turn, you put the chair in neutral. If you had to roll the chair, you would turn the power off. And even with the power off, you can't roll it. But if you push the two levers down, now you're in neutral on both sides. When you're done rolling it, put the two levers right here back up. This is where your motors are at. And now you're back in gear. Turn your power back on and you're ready to go. A couple things about this power chair. The gentleman who had this power chair was a terrible driver. Okay. So on the fender right here, he scraped the top of the fender right here. He probably went under a table or did something right there. That's only superficial. And right here, I'm going to take the arm off so you can see right here, there's a, there's a little, well, I wouldn't say little and it, and, and I, I can probably, I'll, I'll sew it. So it'll be sewed together. You won't even have the gap. I'll sew it together. So you won't even see that probably. But the reason he did that, he had the arms way too tight in this boat right here. He had this like this. And every time you put the seat down, of course, this bolt would pull this, so we'll, we'll, fix, we'll fix that. We're not going to change the seat because it's way too expensive and the seat is, you know, 50 hours. It's like new. So you also have a safety belt on here and the seat is roughly on this chair is like 21 inches wide, 20 by 18. So the seat is 20 wide by 18 deep on the back of the chair. You have a pouch and the original owner's manual from the factory from Hub Around. So let's recap. Well, before we recap, let's talk about when you charge the chair, you'll take your Hub Around charger right here and you'll plug it right below your joystick. And as soon as the light on your Hub Around charger goes to green right here, the charger will stop charging. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this charger right back here so we don't lose it. So it'll be back there when we do the video outside. So this is a hover around MPV5 with the five inch seat lift. The seat is 20 by 18 deep. It's a fold down seat. The arms flip up. The joystick's on the right. If you're left handed, we can switch the joystick to the left side. It has the regular tires that will hover around two batteries. It has a distance of about 15 miles, but that's in perfect condition. So if you're going outside in the grass uphill, you're not going to get, you're not going to get 15 miles. This is the hover around MPV five with the five inch seat lift. And we're keeping the seat on this chair this way. And we're not, and we're, we're keeping the, the scrape on the fender is going to stay like that. We're not fixing that. It's just not worth it uh, because the chair is in excellent condition. It's ready to go. So this is the Hover Around MPV5. 
This one has 49 miles, so it was used two or three months by a bad driver. Runs like brand new. When you stop, the chair comes to a halt within a couple feet because it has electromagnetic brakes. So within a couple feet, it'll stop. Um, it does have a seat lift. I'll show you that in a minute, but let's take it for a ride here. So this chair will go in the grass, on concrete. So if you need a power chair with a seat lift, uh, it does go through the grass. My grass is a little deep right now, so it has a little bit of trouble in the grass, but uh, on flat surface, concrete, like you should have any problem at all. This is the MPV5 with the five inch seat lift, ready to go. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We're co-owners of Mark's Mobility. I started this company in 1995. We sell many products, not just what you see in this video. If you have any questions or concerns, please call us at the number below at 800-677-6293. Thank you and have a wonderful day.